I'm here today to share with you all some e.l.f. goodies, which is eyes, lips, and face products that I scored by shopping at one of the stores located on 59th Street here in New York City. And I want to show you some of the things that I picked up. So um, when you shop in the store, they give you a complimentary little makeup bag that looks like this right here. And it's cute. I mean, it's durable. You can just throw your stuff in here. But it's kind of like a thank you gift when you go shopping in there. So that's the first thing. I just wanted to get that out the way before I forget. So now, if you are an official Glam Doll to this channel, and when I say official, that means a subscribe Glam Doll, you know I have oily skin. And it's really difficult for me to find skincare products that can combat against the oil seeping through when I, you know, wear my makeup and stuff. So while I was in there, I seen that Elf has this oil control liquid lotion that's infused with tea tree oil that looks like um, this right here. And this is what it's looking like when you get it out of its packaging. And I'm super excited. And it says to use just a pea sized amount onto the fingertips and gently smooth it over skin. So I'm really hoping that this works. Cause you know, I'm gonna come back and tell y'all if it do or rather if it don't, whatever. So the next thing that I have to share with you, I picked up is a face blending brush. And this one says selfie ready stipple face blending brush and this is what it's looking like out of its packaging i haven't used the um stipple version before so this will be my first time using this brush once i do i'm definitely going to use everything that i'm showing you i'm going to use in a single video and do my first impressions with you all next thing out the bag okay i picked up a mad for matte eyeshadow palette and this one has a lot of jewel tone colors and let me get it out of its packaging so you can see what it's looking like so when you get it out of its packaging, voila, these are the colors right here. When you get it out of its packaging, these are all jewel tone, beautiful looking colors. I'm super, super excited because you know fall is coming, so I can't wait to dig into that. I'm going to use this well before the fall get here, but I just wanted to share with you all those colors. I picked up another Stardust Glitter Liner in Pink Opal. These are just glittered liquid liners. That's all they are and what else oh one more liquid liner in the color called shimmering gold that looks like that right there shimmering gold oh my bag is almost empty i told you this was a real quick haul oh do not laugh do not laugh but i picked up the wrinkle refiner and clear this is like a pore filler you're going to put this underneath the areas of your eyes like i have little fine wrinkles up underneath there i wouldn't necessarily say wrinkle from aging or anything like that but my foundation tends to seep right in those little fine lines and then it begins to look a little cakey so this is what it's looking like out of its packaging i'm going to give this wrinkle refiner a try this is supposed to fill in those lines to help to create a more smoother surface when i apply my um concealer or my highlight underneath the areas of my eyes so i definitely gonna be letting y'all know how that works and comment down below and not you don't have to be considered mature or older woman but do any of you have those little fine like lines right you know like right here right underneath your eyes right there that drives me absolutely crazy i kid you not oh the next thing that i picked up is some baked highlighter in apricot glow that looks like that right there in apricot glow as a matter of fact let me just take this out of its packaging super super quick so you can get a fair chance to see it up close looks like that right oh look at that glow oh my gosh look at that let me swap i'm gonna swatch it for you wait for it wait for it oh oh look at that okay come through highlight come through highlight you see that right there swatching let me apply it let me see come through highlight oh yes come through i'm so silly <laughs> But at least you see that I did apply it to use it. This is gorgeous. Oh, yes. 
Yes, I'm gonna use this as eyeshadow too. I don't follow the rules when it comes to makeup. I use them as eyeshadows, blushes, whatever I feel like doing with it. Now, the last thing that I have to share with you, and then my video is over, I picked up another uh, brush, but this is the Featherlight highlighting brush. And look at that, it's a highlighting, I forgot. This is a highlighting brush, so I didn't even have to use my fingers for the other thing, but let me take it out of the packaging. This is what it's going to look like. I'm going to get it out of it. Can I get it out? There we go. Oh, look at that. Oh, just go like that. This feels good. Oh, I can't wait to use this. Yeah, that's that. But on that note, dolls, this pretty much just um concluded the video because there's nothing else for me to now show you all. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. And I will see you all in another video again shortly. And later, dolls.